Thunder. And today, ooh, we got a brand new Fortnite drop box to look at. Oh yay, more Fortnite figures. We do the floss. Boo, 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 Zombie boo, Stim, will you stop that so I can do some unboxing? No. Ha ha ha. Brother. All right, guys, well, we've got brand new incoming. Ha, from Moose Toys with the Fortnite Battle Royale Collection. I just love these figures because they're so small and they're really awesome. So, yep, this Battle Royale Collection is great. And I'm so excited because it looks like we've got new two packs here. All right, neat. We've got, uh, oh, yeah, some accessories. That's pretty cool. And last but not least, we've got vehicles this time around, too. Oh, man, this is going to be one awesome collection to put together. But first things first, I like to open up the uh, two packs first. So it looks like we've got four new ones in all. And each one is more interesting than the next. Looks like this one is 4th of July themed. This one is Halloween themed. Ah, right, cool. And this one is Burger Time themed. <laughs> oh, man, I like this the best. Look at that guy right there. Oh, with the stunk tongue sticking out. And let's see, that guy is called the Beef Boss. Oh, I can see that. Okay, I want to open up this first because ha, oh, that's the most interesting looking character. So let's get this beef boss out of here. And talk about a figure that looks good enough to eat. Ha, this one takes the cake. Or a uh, burger bun. Yeah, I just love that big old tongue coming out of that burger. And boy, what a great looking figure. He's got tons of articulation. And he's got some cool weapons too. Like this spatula here and some fries. Oh, gross. Someone should deck this guy out with his accessories. It's time to definitely fry up some fun with uh, that fry backpack of his. Ha, oh, that's so cool. And the guy that comes with him is the uh, grill surgeon. Oh, I love it. Look, look at that. He looks like he's about to take my order. Hey, welcome to the Fortnite Burger Place. Can I take your order, please? Uh, yeah, I'll take about 50 Happy Meals. All right, I think that could be arranged. Just step into my office right here, and I will serve you up good. Oh, cool, there's McDonald's right there. Oh, man, that's crazy. And, of course, if we put them side by side with that burger guy there, I can see why they packaged them together, because they look great. Oh, this is so great to see more people made out of burger buns. Oh, Mayor McCheese, oh, you guys are the best. Oh, I love it. I just wonder if they have a character that's comparable to Grimace here. <laughs> well, I think not, but uh, this one comes close. This is the Fireworks Team Leader. Uh, she looks pretty cool. And then the Star Spangled Trooper off to the side. And, oh, weird. I guess these are 4th of July themed. But, of course, they come in a couple months late. And talk about some festive coloring. Holy cow, she takes the cake. Uh, she's all blue with red and white pants. Got all that patriotic spirit of hers. Especially since she comes with that really cool Uncle Sam's hat with, uh, I think, fireworks in it. Oh, I love it. I see the uh, troop guy right next to her, who's also decked out in all kinds of patriotic colors. The Star Spangled Trooper. Oh, and he's decked out for some patriotic fun. Now, the weird thing about this two-pack here is they seem to be repaints of figures we've gotten in the past. We've actually gotten the Cuddle Team Leader before, but she was painted a little bit differently. And we've actually got this Trooper before, but he was painted as Jonesy. So, yep, looks like they reskinned them or painted them for this collection here. Okay, it's on to our next two pack here. And, ooh, cool, this is the Halloween themed one featuring Heyman and Hollowhead. Oh, these are some really cool looking figures. So I can't wait to add these to my collection. So pull out old Heyman here. Oh, I just love this character. He's probably one of my favorite yet because I just love Halloween. He looks super cool. From head to toe, he looks just like a scarecrow. Oh, I love it. And his accessories are just as amazing because he comes with a scythe, that pistol there. If we turn him around, oh, just look at that backpack. Ah, oh, it's a little Heyman that's hanging from his body. Well, we actually get the figure of Hollowhead next. He is one cool looking dude. Look at that pumpkin for a head. And he's got a cape on the back. And his weapons are just as cool. Look at this. We get another scythe. That looks phenomenal. Ha! <laughs> you just got like those guys with pumpkin heads. Oh, they're the best. Oh, really? Whoa, 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 whoa. I didn't mean you. Oh, too late, Puppet Steve. Ah, oh, you said it. But, but. Oh, thought God he caught me. Ah. Ah, well, at any rate, I bet these guys are going to be very hard to find at retail because everyone's going to want these guys, and they look great, too. So if you see them, you probably should pick them up before everybody takes them. 
Okay, kids, so it looks like we have one last two-pack here. And, uh, wait a minute, these are like more repaints? Oh man, we've already gotten drift before. So let's get this out of here. And here we have the figure of Drift, which uh, I think we've gotten before in the past. Yep, oh, there's the old figure of Drift. And you know what? This is actually a different version. Ugh, because this one has a jacket and that one doesn't. So I guess this is a new figure. And we also get one last really interesting accessory. Ooh, a change of the head. Oh, neat. So I guess we can display Drift with this head? Well, this is a different twist. I've seen a lot of different Drift figures from McFarland Toys and Jazzwares. This is the first time that they've offered a different head for this character. Now, in addition to this new Drift character, we also get this painter girl right here, which I think we've gotten her before. With this figure right here? Nope, but it looks like I'm wrong again. And you know what? This figure is called Abstract, where this one is called Technique. So, nope, not the same character. They're different entirely, but looks like they both like paint. And with that, we now have our set of eight brand new two-pack figures coming at you from series three of the Fortnite figures. Now all we need are some accessories to complete this set, and guess what? We've got them right here! Ha! <laughs> oh man, watch out guys, because they're incoming too! Let's see, we've got this uh, Meltdown Glider, complete with the Visitor character. Oh yes, I'm glad we finally get him in the Moose Toys line. And then we get this really cool golf cart called the All-Terrain Cart with Drift. Wait a minute, his name's Drift too? How can that be? Her name's Drift. Oh man, this gets so confusing. But uh, first things first, let's open up this glider because I can't wait to get the, the figure of the visitor there. Talking about an amazing figure. Oh, I just love this dude's helmet. He looks great. Looks like a bounty hunter dude ready for battle. He comes complete with those two big guns and that really cool jetpack thing on the back. Oh yeah, now that's what I'm talking about making this guy looking super cool. And well, just like the bunny hunter of Bubba Fett. And the similarities are uncanny. Look at that, rocket packs, weapons, helmets. Boy, that's crazy. Yep, I should blast you right now for copying me. I'm not copying you, I promise. <laughs> Get back here, you. <laughs> and you might wanna grab this next accessory, which is the Meltdown Glider. So it's pulling all these out of the box. Looks like we have three here. We've got two which are the base. So snap that into there. All right, cool. And on the top, snap in our glider, which looks like that. And this is pretty cool because I don't remember seeing this at Toy Fair, so this is new to me. And that's awesome because, well, when this visitor character wants to get away from Boba Fett, I've got you cornered. Think again, Boba Fett. Ha <laughs> ha, now time to fly away. Oh, doggone it. All right, kids, now it's time to check out the biggest and coolest accessory of them all, the all-terrain golf cart. Oh, yeah. And this also comes with the exclusive figure of another version of Drift. But nonetheless, just check this guy out. He's got gold hair and a little mask over his face. Oh, man, looks like he's ready for some uh, golf carting. Oh, mama, and he's also packing some serious heat. But enough of this guy, because I know you guys all want to see that really awesome golf cart accessory that he rides in. So let's get this out of the package here. And check this thing out. Aw, oh, yes! This looks like one awesome terrain vehicle with little dice in the mirror. Ha <laughs> I just love that little attention to detail. We've got this little guy right there. And it comes complete with a steering wheel. And you can also put a flag in the back so you can, uh, I guess, capture the flag. <laughs> oh, that's fun. Now, like I said, there are two sets of prongs, one in the vehicle and one outside the vehicle. So I guess we can put this exclusive character up front here, and then we can put uh, oh, the visitor in the back, like so. All right, that's a nice little mashup that we can have here. Hey, visitor, where to, man? I don't know, just away from here. Oh, yeah? Well, you're not getting away that easy. Oh, man, it's Bubba Fett. Oh, let's get out of here quick, quick, quick. All right, man. Get back here. Oh no, looks like the race is on. Get back here. Ah! Hey, sports fans, welcome back to the golf championships. And we're here at the eighth hole waiting for the golf champion here to make his putt. And uh, oh, oh my God, oh. Oh, that golf cart just came along and ran right over him. I'm gonna get you. Whoa, a tree going up. Ah! 
Oh, you ran into that tree. Oh, you moron. Ha <laughs> I got you. And now I'm going to vaporize you. Goodbye, you. Ha, nobody outruns Bubba Fett. Ugh, my golf cart. Oh, I scratched my golf cart. Ugh. All right, Fortnite fans. Well, I know we had a lot coming at you today. We had a bunch of two-pack figures, gliders, and we had some really cool golf cart. All right, kids, so all this stuff should be available at retail right now. So if you want some for your very own, make sure you check out Target and Walmart.